Medical marijuana benefits versus risk of using it. The debate over the legalization of marijuana for medical use, typically referred to as cannabis when prescribed by doctors, is an intense battle that has been going on for years. Thus, cannabis and the medical marijuana benefits is in a gray zone and seems destined to remain there for quite some time. Millions of mar people use marijuana. Various people use it recreationally, and some for its medical marijuana benefits. While the popular plant has been used for medicinal purposes for centuries, the debate on its effectiveness continues. We know the Food and Drug Administration has already approved synthetic cannabinoid, which is the active ingredient in marijuana, for use in patients and more are undergoing phase 3 clinical trials in the United States for the treatment of cancer pain. Yet, the Drug Enforcement Agency lists marijuana under the Schedule 1 category of controlled substances, meaning it has a high potential for abuse and has no current accepted medical purpose in the United States and is not deemed safe for use. The DEA stands has made it difficult for scientists to push forward national clinical trials for the natural, not the synthetic, medical marijuana benefits. Still, in the last three years, more than 6,000 studies have been published in scientific journals about marijuana medical benefits and the cannabis plant, according to Normal, an organization that works to legalize marijuana. Research has shown that there are both marijuana medical benefits and risk, just as any type of medication patients are prescribed by medical doctors. Medical Benefits Medical marijuana can treat a number of conditions in patients. For example, anxiety and post-traumatic stress disorder has been reported to respond to treatment with marijuana. The marijuana medical benefits are virtually unlimited. Even the National Cancer Institute says the potential benefits of medical cannabis for people living with cancer, including anemic effects, appetite stimulations, pain relief, and improved sleep. Most patients report fewer side effects than with traditional drugs because marijuana is a naturally occurring substance. It carries fewer risks than chemically processed drugs. Psychological Effects the psychological effects of cannabinoids, such as anxiety reduction, sedation, and euphoria can influence their potential medical marijuana benefits. In some patients, there is a mild and short-lived withdrawal symptom. The symptoms include restlessness, irritability, mild agitation, insomnia, sleep disturbance, and cramping. So needless to say, those effects are potentially undesirable for certain patients and situations and beneficial for others. Physiological risk. The most significant risk imposed by marijuana is that, unlike many other medications, there are no recommended dosing requirements. Thus, patients have to experiment with dosing, method of administration, and strain. Smoking marijuana, you have other options to medicate, for example, digestion, topical application, etc poses a risk on lungs and may cause other respiratory problems. However, except for the harm on your lungs associated with smoking marijuana, the adverse effects of marijuana use are within the acceptable range of side effects that is tolerated for many other pharmaceutical medications. The physiological risks of medical use of marijuana are not necessarily the same or nearly as harmful as the physical effects as other types of drug use. Conclusion It seems the main question is do medical marijuana benefits outweigh the risk? While the benefits and risk of medicating with marijuana may be overstated by advocates and opponents of marijuana legalization, the new legalization will help researchers study the marijuana medical benefits and uses and better understand how it impacts the body. Currently, we do know medical marijuana does confer more benefits on patients than the risk. The risks are extremely minimal. In most cases, marijuana medical benefits have less risk than prescribed pharmaceutical drugs. 
Others have pointed out marijuana use has been part of the human existence for centuries and has been used historically to treat some health problems in addition to alleviating mental health concerns. Let us know what you think.